Did you know that with just one small chip, the 555 Timer IC, you can build dozens of cool electronics projects? Today, I am showing you the top 5 555 Timer projects you can build right now on a breadboard. And it's simple, fun, beginner friendly, and project 4 is a digital display that spells pop and m using a decade counter circuit the 555 timer works in a stable monostable and bistable modes we will mostly use a stable to generate clocks and square waves so let's build our first project is the classic led flasher by wiring the 55 timer in a stable mode with a capacitor and two resistors, it automatically charges and discharges, making the LED blink on and off. This simple circuit is the foundation for so many other 555 timer projects. You can even change the resistor or capacitor values to adjust the blinking speed. Next up is the sound generator. Here, the 55 timer produces a square wave signal that drives a small speaker. The frequency of the sound changes depending on the resistor and capacitor values. As you can see, you can use the variable resistor to make it sound like a siren and it's super fun and really easy to build. You can see the schematic for the sound generator using the 555 timer IC. For our third project, let's make a light detector. This uses an LD arrow, that is light dependent resistor, that changes resistance with light. When it's dark, the 55 timer output turns on an LED. When it's bright, the LED turns off. This is the basis for things like automatic night lights. For our fourth project, we are making a mini Macway. A 555 timer sends clock pulses to a CD4017 DK counter, which lights the letter POP and M one at a time. By tying the fifth output back to reset, the display loops continuously. And when you adjust the potentiometer to change the scrolling speed, and that's your own glowing POP and M. And you can see how the 55 timer is sending the clock pulse to display the pop and m through the dk counter ic our final project is the pwm led dimmer and the dc motor speed control here the 555 timer generates a pulse width modulation signal and by adjusting a potentiometer we can change the duty circle of the signal and that controls the brightness of the led this same principle is used in motor speed as you can see on screen and even in modern power supplies and that you've just made it with a single 555 timer here you have it guys five amazing 555 timer projects you can build on a breadboard which one was your favorite let me know in the comment section below if you enjoyed this video hit the like button and subscribe because i will be sharing even more diy electronics and arduino projects you don't want to miss out Thank you for watching and happy building. See you in my next video and bye-bye.